Hey guys, Pretty here, welcome back to Biker Garage. Here we are for another episode. We're going to continue on from where we left off. We've got a bike here we need to fix. We've also got our um, cruiser over here, which has a lot of stuff wrong with it. We need to have a look and um, see what else we need to fix. There's a lot of stuff here, as you can see, that needs replacing. Um, probably a lot of stuff that we can't actually see that needs replacing too. So let's, let's get started, start taking some things off. Passenger seat, rear frame, rear license plate can go. Um, we've got exhaust or the muffler. Dual sided muffler. What else do we have? We've got cooler at the front. Um, we've got gauges. Front reflector. Uh, handlebars, all that other left handlebars, dodgy. Right handlebars, dodgy. Um, what else do we have? Let's go back to diagnose. We got are they? Yeah, the rear springs are dodgy. Whatever that is, quick shift is dodgy. Right, so we should have probably started putting these guys on the list. So I want two springs. I want the right foot rest, because um, there's no spring on that side at all. So we need to take that off. The left foot rest is pretty good, got a quick shift pedal. Take that off, we'll come around the other side. Take this off. Oh, that's pretty good, two broken parts. Brake pad and right foot rest, yep, okay, cool. Um, I don't know if... You can actually get into the brake pad. Oh, there we go, brake pads. Alright, so let's go into the shop. Uh, we could bring this up as well, we can. Cruiser MG. Alright, um, brake pad we need. Shifter, rear spring, so let's go quick. Quick shifter, rear spring, two of those. Oop, get rid of that. What else was there? Right foot rest, so right foot rest, done. I've got a list of other stuff too. Um, we're gonna go cooler. Cooler, we'll go a reflector. Go handlebar, so we need the left handlebar and the right handlebar I believe. We need gauges, need license, oh, license plate, uh, brake pad which we've already done, quick shift we've already done, we need muffler, need passenger seat. Uh, we don't have one of those so we'll grab one of those too. Um, and I don't know about these guys. I guess we'll have to find out. Alright, so let's go with our cooler, put our cooler back on. We should have had a look to see if we could repair any of these things. That would have been a good idea, wouldn't it? Alright, gauges. Um, left handlebar. We've got no mirrors, so. Left mirror, have to go right mirror, why'd that go through twice, I don't know, um, right, zoom back out, we need to go down the front here and look at trying to get somewhere, there we go, brake pads, um, let's go the muffler, A rear suspension and the spring. Don't actually have the footrest, which is oh, and a chain. Um, where's the other passenger footrest? We've got that. Also got the spring. We've got the rear license plate. 
Alright, we've got the passenger seat. And the passenger rest. Uh, what else do we need? But we don't have a brake pedal. We have a right foot rest though. Is there anything else that I can't can't see? Um, quick shift to somewhere. There it is. Got something else there. Kickstand. We don't have. All right. Let's go back into. Oop, not into there. So we need yep, the foot rest. Foot rest. Let's go mirror. Left mirror. Right mirror. Chain. Kickstand. And the brake pedal. Now is that it? Oh, I need to get rid of that. There we go. Right, so the kickstand. Um, footrest, chain, I think that's pretty much going to be it, I hope. Alright, right passenger foot, uh, the brake pedal, get that done, there we go, and we've got the two, two mirrors that we can get the right angle. Mirror, right mirror, and then technical condition is not very good. Um, yeah, so the oil and stuff has got no oil or anything in it. So let's bring this over. Lift two. Oh, can I do one thing at a time? Maybe. Yeah, I don't know. Don't know what that is either. Um, and we need the air compressor, which is here. Move to lift two. Well, let's go service. Um, right handle. Where is the brake kit? Where did it go? Over here. Why was it at lift one? I don't know. Only one thing at a time. So that's a little bit frustrating. Alright, I'll fill this right up. Alright, back out of there. Let's go to front brake caliper. Make sure we get that full. Awesome. I'll go back to the right handle, fill it back up again. There should be something to do with the rear brakes as well. Okay, technical condition. Front wheel, rear wheel. Right foot rest, where's the brake pedal? No, that's, they're all fine, they're happy with that. I don't think... I don't know. Let's pump the rear tyre up. There we go. Let's come down to the front wheel. I wish it would disappear when it was actually fully done. Um, that's done. So we need to come over to here, go engine oil to lift number two. Service the engine oil. We need to find where the battery is and charge a battery to. So it's probably under the seat. Um, I don't know what that is. Is that actually like chain oil? Wish things had, you know, a bit more. Oh, can we get to the chain? There we go. Yeah, that must be the chain oil. We need to pull the battery off and charge the battery. We'll put a new battery on one of the two. Alright, so let's go 
pull this apart. Let's have a look at. Hopefully, this the battery's under the seat. Um, ECU, ABS pump. There's the battery. Take the cables off. Battery out. Uh, where's our battery charger thing? Over here. Here we go. Charging in progress. Awesome. Charged. Let's just repair all this stuff. We're going to sell it anyway. So we're certainly going to make more money than we spent. Um, I think we had 1100 and something. We should get nearly 1200 and something by the time we finish this. Um, Alright, assembly. New battery in. Go. Seat frame. Seat itself. Then the passenger seat. Oop, wrong one. No, you want. Why did that still want us to put it on there? There we go. Assembly. Good passenger seat. Lights work. It starts. Awesome. Main job. Everything should be good with that now. So that is a full restoration, pretty much, and that is actually a really, really nice looking bike. It really is. Do a screenshot from this angle, but that is really nice. Um, that's done. Done. 1200. There we go. So there's still four of these guys done. That's done. This is our gear problem one, so this is going to be interesting. Getting the gear problems done with this. Um, I don't know why I ran all the way over here. We just used our tablet. I will just sell these guys. Alright. Whoa. Lag. Jesus. That was a big lag. A big bit of lag. Alright. So I wish there was a way that we can utilize all these, just get rid of all of them in one big go instead of having to just press and wait every single time. They're probably not too far away from, hopefully, unlocking the ability to make our own bikes. Yeah, that would be pretty cool. It's obviously where we want to go to. Um, uh, Furious at $700. Yep, we'll do that, and we'll do that as well. Rockstar. That's just auction, but junkyard doesn't matter. 5% less per parts. Yeah, let's do that. Alright, spent a little bit of money, but cool. Let's have a look at this thing. Diagnose. Parts to check gear and a transmission case, so I don't know exactly. The tranny case is obviously there on the back. Take the muffler and stuff off. Chain off. Fuel tank. I don't know why we have to take the mirror and stuff off, that's weird. Obviously to get that off. Right, let's go back to here. To the I think that's going to drop oil on the ground, isn't it? No, maybe not. The front fairing. Oh, exhaust pipes have got to go. Engine, what else are we missing? Quick shifter. Take that out. Alright. Oh no. Spilled engine all on the floor. Right, this thing is still. Highlighted. Can we stop that from highlighting? Probably not. Alright, let's um, diagnose. So the gear, tranny case. Gears 15%. Tranny case is no good. Um, I 
Alright. Need to pull the gear out, so we need to pull off the... The housing on this side, primary housing. Can we get the lag? Oh, this lag is shocking. Chain, clutch. Alright, some more housing. The gears are gone. Sprockets, alright. Want the gears. Right, the tranny case as well. I want to take that off. We mentioned to take the starter off. It said it wouldn't actually start, so I'm not exactly sure why it won't start. Maybe the battery could be dead. Right, there we go. Uh, get rid of that. Some missing parts. We've got heaps, but that's fine. Right, so we need to see, can we get the gears? Ooh, uh, 65%. 58%, I think you need more than that, doesn't he? 70%, so yeah, not even close. Um, v engine, gear, and tranny case. Engines, V engine. Gear, wow, it's expensive. Transmission case, can we sell? Alright, be very careful here not to sell something we need. Transmission case can go. And the old. Old V engine gears, maybe we can't sell them because they're that far gone. Ah, oh, there we go. Alright, now let's put this thing back together. Go tranny case. All new gears. Certainly looks better. Right, starter motor. Uh, what else do we need now? Sprocket. Primary housing. Put the clutch back in. the chain and then the cover on it, we should be pretty well good to go. Oh, and the, don't forget the oil pan. Beautiful, let's double check, make sure there's nothing else. Pretty sure there's nothing else. Let's go to diagnose. Everything looks good. Alright, can we go? Alright, get out of that. Come back over to the bike. Got assembly. Engine back in. They're saying there's something wrong with the technical part of the bike, which I think would be engines has got no oil and stuff in it, which is fine. We can look at that so after we get it all put back together. Make sure we do that before we start it so we don't damage anything. Um, which I did do in the beta testing. Alright, fuel tank. It's quite a hefty job though. Well, there's a lot of stuff you got to pull off to get get to what you need to do. Alright, the mirror on. Left handle. Um, Muffler. What are we missing now? Chain and the quick shifter. Yep, cool. It's good. I like it how they've actually done that because it's so easy to just miss things. Right, so engine oil. Now this one, move to lift one. I don't know if we actually need the compressor over here. No.
Boom, there we go. Now it should be fine. Lights are on, it starts, runs fine. Uh, mail. Done, done. Beautiful. 456. There's a few more mechanic life ones. Not going to worry about those just yet. Um, Chuck at McCoy86. Make a hole again. Hello, I had to fight these bad guys recently. They didn't stand a chance against me, but they damaged my motorcycle. It's fixing it up for the challenge. Yes. Alright, so there's two here. Well, it's this one. This is the Enduro TA. That's a lot of money. And look at it. Holy crap. Um, look at all the parts we need to fix on that one. Chop a long fork. Another one. Um, yeah, let's let's accept this one. This bike is damaged. Look at this. This thing is beautiful. If it wasn't so damaged, it would be even more beautiful. But that is awesome. So what I what I did, um, in case you guys aren't sure, is I go into here. I go check screenshot. That way you got a list of parts you can use. If you've got two screens like me, you can just pile the parts from one screen. So much easier. Um, got this guy to look at now. So this is this is crazy. A um, few things we need to inspect. All right. So what do we need? We need swing arm and a rear frame. That's all we need. That's all it's telling me we need. So need to take the swing arm. No, the swing arm off. No, oh, swing arm. Got to take a heap of stuff off to get to what we need. Which really, you know, doesn't surprise me, I suppose. Um, take that off, take the chain guard. Chain itself. Got to get this back tire off, so the sprocket. Uh, break stuff. Yep, yeah, there we go. Oh, I've done it again. I need to take the brake pads out first. This is really stupid. It should come out as one package. Right, rear wheel. Alright, we need to take out rear swing arm off. So the whole rear end's got to be taken apart. Battery. Why won't that come out? Aha! Uh -huh. ABS pump. Another line. ABS pump. Rear frame. Right, and I don't know how much he needs. As far as 70%. Alright, player stats. Handyman. We've got Handyman touch. Final clue of each part is crystal 1%. Yes, let's get both of those. Um, 70%. Let's see if we can get either of these to 70%. Maybe the rear frame. No, not close. That too, but we'll. Guess we need to just buy both of them. Um, sport 1000 swing arm and rear frame. So bike sport 1000 rear frame swing arm cell. Yep. So we didn't lose too much. 4266. Not too bad. Whoa. So the lag's still a little bit bad at some points. Right, let's go rear frame. And the swing arm. Are the two parts that we needed. Get that bit on. Rear wheel. Chain guard probably could have waited, but anyway. First thing I clicked on. The chain on, go around the other side, and we can put the rear disc brakes. 
brake caliper and then the brake pads in there. Which is still, it's really annoying because it's still really back to front for me. Uh, rear fairing can go on. Battery box. My ABS pump. Battery itself. Oh, there we go. Brake pedal hose, We've got the rear hose. Um, rear light. Alright, where are the rest of these hoses that we had to pull off before? There they are. Just see them. Okay, now we can put the seat back on. Side fairings. What are we missing now? Chain guard, okay. Uh, where is it? There it is. Right, technical condition will be obviously break stuff. Just break stuff. Not literally, let's not break stuff literally, but you know what I mean. Right, move to lift number one. Need our compressor over here. Lift number one. Let's go assembly, uh, service even. Pull this reservoir up. We need to get all the hose is done, so never mind. I'll break color part. Pull this one up again. We we'll have to do the rear brake color bar. Brake pedal hose. Obviously, the brake pedal. Should be on this side. I have to top that up as well. Alright, build this back up. Um, Alright, where is brake pedal? Where is the bloody brake pedal? Here, there we go. Then we'll just need to fill up. Fill up this guy again. That's it, the bike should be good to go. Another job done. Alright. Lights work. Starts. Beautiful. Let's clear another job. Boom. A little bit more money. Okay, Lizzie at Lizzie Rider. Hey there, our Facebook group went for a ride last weekend and I almost hit a bike in front of me because I couldn't stop in time. I was a danger for everyone. I was that guy. And I'm not even a guy. So check my bike, would you, Liz? Yes, Liz, we can do that. Alright, ooh, it's a nice bike too. We've got this one to do next episode. We've got this one to do next episode too, which is going to be a huge rebuild. Um, I don't know how bad the, oh, no, the actual engine is. Engine seems to be pretty good, but there's lots of missing parts, lots of broken parts, and a um, shitload of issues with this one. So, right out, guys. If you guys enjoyed this one, as always, smash that like button. Leave a comment. Let me know what you think of this series so far, and if you want to see it continue. If you guys are new to the channel and haven't subscribed yet, guys, please do so. It's been Bruno. Thanks for watching. See you again soon.